Hey friends, it has been a hot minute since I have vlogged and I thought I would just pick up the camera today and try and take you along with our day. So today is Friday. <laughs> Friday, May 11th I think it is. Um, and we are getting ready for Shane to go away to work. He is leaving on Monday and he will be gone till the end of August which just stinks. Um, so my house is in upheaval, our lives are in upheaval, there's a lot of sadness um, mixed with, I guess you could say joy because we're just having fun as a family, um, but it is kind of stressful like trying to do all of the things and getting him ready to go um, for a long time. He will come home like each month, he'll take uh, some different time off and we'll be going away um, to camp and uh, different things like that. Um, so he'll be home a couple times, but it's still it's still just a lot to deal with. So um, he made us uh, a pancake breakfast today. It's oh, oh it's going on twelve thirty right now. So he had made us like a late breakfast. Um, so he's outside cleaning up the yard, and the dogs are. Um, the kids are outside playing with the dogs, so I'm going to go ahead and do my dishes, but first I'm going to change the wax in my Scentsy here in the kitchen, and then I'm going to get my oil diffuser going too. I have been super into oils the past couple months. Um, they honestly, I feel like, have really helped support like a lot of emotions that I've um, been going through, and like truly... Besides, the Word of God and prayer um, has been one of the major things that I think has just really supported me and helped me kind of um, uh, be normal and balanced. Um, anyway, so I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to get all of that going, and um, I'll share with you what I'm warming and what I'm diffusing. Okay, so I am going to warm St. Snickerdoodle, or St. Snickerdoodle. Um, you can't actually get this scent anymore. If you have a Scentsy consultant in your life, you can ask them if they have it. Um, I actually ordered, like, or I bought, like, six bars of this off of a friend of mine. Um, this is, like, one of my all-time favorite scents. It's kind of, uh, I can't even describe it. It's just so delicious and wonderful. So that's the last two bars of this scent. Um, it came in like a holiday pack, and you can't buy that holiday pack, so I'm using them very, very sparingly. Okay, so this is my diffuser. This is also from Scentsy. Um, I am going to diffuse, I use pretty much only doTERRA oils, um, only because that's just what I, what I have. Um, not because I'm like that particular, I just, this is all I have. Um, and I have a wholesale membership with them so I can get them at a discount. Anyways, I'm gonna diffuse bergamot, which is like a citrus sort of scent and um, a blend called Forgive. Um, so I was actually gonna diffuse a blend called Console, but I actually um, think I wanna do Forgive. Um, not that I really need to forgive anybody, but this is just a really emotional kind of day and I just need a little bit of support. Oh, actually, actually never mind. There's already, um, there's already water in my diffuser and oils from yesterday and I don't want to just dump that down the sink because that's pretty wasteful. So, uh, I think it was wild orange and peppermint that I diffused yesterday. So I guess that's what we'll do now. And I'm going to go ahead and get my kitchen cleaned up, wash all these dishes, Yes. So I'm watching Fly Lady um, while I'm getting my dishes done. So question for you guys. Um, I, you all know I have to hand wash my dishes. We don't have a dishwasher. We're getting one soon though and I'm excited. Um, but I always use Dawn dish soap and dish liquid, whatever it is. Um, I'm looking to go a more natural route. I'm curious if anybody has used a more natural dish soap that you really love. I know that suds don't equate um, clean. However, Dawn is just a really good dish soap and it cleans my dishes really, really well. So it's not the suds that I care about. I just want really um, a good, a good, good cleaner because this is all I've got. Um, anyways, I was interested in like seventh generation. Um, 
have you used that? I don't know. I was going to order it from my grocery store, but they didn't have it available. So anyways, let me know if any of you have a good alternative. Hi, Connie. I am here to pick up my groceries. <laughs> oh, no. So we're at the grocery store. We are picking up groceries. We have a grocery order in, and we're just going to get that. And then we're going to go to Costco and get a few more things. And then we might get a helmet. Hello. Yeah. Aubrey's learning to ride a two-wheeler. So we got to get her a helmet. This hers doesn't fit anymore. And we got to the park. I'm doing way more better at the park. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hello? Hi. Someone's on the phone for you. Uh, it's me, Colt. Oh, hey, Colt. How are you? Who are you? <laughs> I'm Mommy. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> We're in the cold room. And they're hugging so that they'll stay warm. I need bananas. Oh, yeah. So we are all filled up here with our groceries. It's a lot of stuff. <laughs> um, and Shane's just running in to exchange a pair of pants that he bought that just didn't quite fit right? They were a little too short. So he's going to do that. And then getting the helmet, starts. maybe we'll see. We'll see. Hold your winky and pee on the cup? Yep. And pee, I like you at pee on. Do you hear it on your green shirt? Oh, don't like pee on that. We had to pull over to the side of the road for a potty break for Colt. Pee on! Coltie, look at Mummy. I see you. I think it's too small. Hello, Ola. That's a lot to wear on a kid's head. Hey. Is that the one you like, Cookie? Yeah. I I need Okay. So we're having dinner in the living room tonight. Um, we're having homemade meatballs that I just pulled from the freezer, and salads. That's my big old salad. Um, and we are watching the crowns and we need to finish up before Shane leaves. He leaves in a couple days so we're trying to power through the rest of the season. So we are headed to the park. Dinner is over. The dishes are done. The kids usually go to bed between sometime between 7 and 7 30 but they are desperate to ride their bikes and this is kind of a special time because their daddy is leaving so he is going to walk with them um, down to the park. I'm actually going to drive which is crazy because it's just down the street but um, I am bringing a couple of the dogs and train which is why I couldn't walk with the dogs um, because there's lots of training equipment so Let's go. Abby was one and you got ice cream and me too. <laughs> no, I didn't get ice cream. 
I saw you riding your bike though. You did such a good job. I'm okay. to come in the truck because it is freezing outside I don't know the temperature but whew, it was cold I just I couldn't deal so my kiddos are running around and Shane is like <laughs> dressed for the weather and I just am not so I'm in here I'm gonna scroll through Pinterest and wait for my family so actually while I'm here I thought I would kind of show you um what I'm doing I just finished up a devotional on the Bible app um, it's called the pursuit. Um, I can't really show you the icon because it's already gone away, but these are the plans that I'm kind of working through. So I've got shine stepping. Oh, I have my kiddos coming. What? I fell in the rock claw again. Good job, bud. I fell in the rock claw. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> um, so there's shine. Um, stepping into the role you were made for, um, breaking free, um, and this is with Beth Moore, and then these two I haven't started yet, but um, I have them on here, Moments with God for Moms with Karen Stubbs, y'all know I love that podcast, um, Birds on Wire Moms, and then No More Unglued Mama Mornings, so I haven't started those two yet, I wanted to get through these other ones first, and then um, I'll start those, so anyways, that's what I'm kind of looking at here and this is the app it's whoa come back it's the holy bible app so we're trying to okay. determine which roof tile what is it it's called to do um ruby shingling <laughs> and we did get a helmet i'll show you mine and probably colt will show you his for mine okay okay look Look at them. Mm -hmm. Lift your helmet. Turn around. <laughs> Side. Okay. Very cool. I love your helmet. Me too. So it's the end of the night. I don't know. It's like 9.30 at this point, And I'm going to go ahead and edit my video. Shane has gone to a friend's house to work on some um, stuff. And he'll be back in a little bit. And then we'll probably watch his show and go to bed. He has to leave really early tomorrow morning. He is um, <clears throat> taking a couple of our dogs to southern Ontario. Um, a friend of his is going to train them and watch after them um, while he's away because the summer is a good time for, <clears throat> excuse me, all of their like competition, like hunting dog training um, to happen. And Shane could if he was home, but he's not going to be home. So this friend is going to kind of fill in the gap, keep them exercised and on point and ready for the fall when all the trials happen. So anyways, he's leaving tomorrow morning very early, so it'll be a early night for us. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll check with you, check, check, chat with you later. <laughs> Bye.